When it's just you, well, times can be tough. When there's no one there. A story is very important. We're telling the story of Aloy and it's fantastic to follow her personal motivation throughout the world. We explore her origins. She is trying to answer the question where she came from, who her parents are. At the start of the game, Aloy is an outcast. She lives with the tribe, but sort of in an, in an isolated location. When she tries to interact with people, they kind of shun her. But there are some people that uh, do want to talk with her, and fortunately there are some merchants that allow some limited trading as well. We have a number of quests in which you can play uh, young Aloy. We use the child uh, Aloy sequences mostly for tutorializing uh, the mechanics to the player, the very basics. Uh, and as soon as you're the adult Aloy, that's when a lot of the skills and the bigger machines actually come into play. So one of the things that was really important for us is that as Aloy discovers the world, Peggy, the player discovers the world as well. She hasn't seen a lot of the world, she's always lived in a tiny village. And for the player also, Peggy, they at the beginning of the game haven't seen a lot of this world yet, so it's all about exploration. The world that Aloy lives in, Peggy, wasn't her world. They're not the first people in this world, and that's something, Peggy, that we wanted the player to be able to discover. Peggy, going into these ancient ruins and Peggy finding what this civilization was, what ended that civilization and sort of started the world in a new form. None of the tribes really remember what happened before. As far as they know, the world has always been like this. And when we just started designing these tribes, Peggy, we sort of went sort of like anthropologists. We, we looked at the environment that these people have started in and maybe how they would have developed, what sort of resources were around, what sort of things they, they could hunt, what sort of things they could eat, and also basically the machines basically that live in their environment. Right from the get-go basically we invest a lot in characterization, in Aloy as a character, into the stories of the tribe, all the background stories, and that basically was a major point of information for all the design decisions and also all the art directional decisions that we made along the development of the project. This is really the story of Aloy, so even though the machines define the world, uh, they are the dominant species, it's still very much Aloy's journey. Through her story, you unravel the bigger mysteries. Get increased stealth and increased accuracy when you pre-order at GameStop. PlayStation.